What's up YouTube, Clues Bushcraft here. Today I'm going to be making a gourd container that'll hold water or alcohol. I'm going to be sealing it with uh, paraffin wax. It's this right here. I'm going to be melting this down and sealing the inside of it with this to kind of waterproof it. Uh, I've never worked with it before but we're going to attempt to try it. Uh, today and I'm just gonna get right into it if you guys want to see my previous video where I uh, melted uh, beeswax you can uh, click on the tab up here and check that video out all right all right so you guys will want to clean out the gourd so I just saw it off the top here and I just grab a stick like this and I just scrape the inside of it basically to get out all of the seeds and all of the material that's on the inside of it um, and so I did that before I filmed this so this is pretty much ready to go uh, I'm just gonna get the water boiled and the wax heated up and just pour some in and then mix it around all right so this is paraffin wax um, it's odorless and flavorless and so when it's melted um, this will coat the inside and it'll actually work a lot better than beeswax because uh, the beeswax actually has a smell um, and, and it, over time it just kind of deteriorated. I'll show you guys my old one at the end of the video. But paraffin wax is really flammable. Uh, once it gets too hot it'll actually combust so that's why I'm using the double boiler method so I'm gonna boil up this water and I'm gonna have it like this in here and I'm just gonna place this in here so you can actually see it slowly melting um, the reason why we're actually doing this is so that uh, temperature doesn't get past the boiling point of water so the uh, paraffin wax doesn't have a chance to combust. Um, if I were to do it over the stove on itself um, it'll get too hot and then it'll actually combust on its own. This way is just kind of like a safer way to do it. So you can see it's almost fully melted. There's just a small piece left. All right, so it's completely melted. I'm we'll just pour it in now. And I have this from my old one. I'm just gonna use this to kind of. Ooh. Okay, be careful because it's hot and so it's gonna... Yeah, that worked pretty well. I'm gonna let this cool down and then I'm gonna pour in another batch and then just shake it around again. I think that's perfectly coated. <laughs> All right, so it's pretty much done here. All I need to do is make a cork like this here for this one. Uh, this one here is for my old one. There you go. So this one is axed with uh, beeswax. This one here today was paraffin wax. Um, I like this so much more because I have water in it. And it doesn't smell like beeswax. And there's really, there's hardly a smell to it really. And this is so much better. 
like this one here I like the shape and everything and it was waxed very well but the only issue with this one is because it's beeswax you can smell it and uh, I mean it's not a bad smell but it kind of changes this like the taste the aroma of water or anything else that you have in it so I've had alcohol in this one I've had this bottle for about a year now and uh, my previous video actually did very well it uh, has like 5,000 views on it or something like that which is ridiculous to me I never even thought that the video would actually get that big um, but I had a lot of questions about how if if people are able to use this as a container for alcohol and uh, I have been using this for alcohol here and there um, like hard liquors beer wine anything you name it. <laughs> it it works in here but I wouldn't keep the alcohol in here for that long um, because I feel like the alcohol would strip the wax maybe I'm not really sure but I don't think it's really a good idea to keep alcohol in here for too long but with a paraffin wax it might actually work better with alcohol so I'm not really sure I'm gonna try it out um, and uh, and let you guys know in the future uh, but I hope you guys enjoyed watching the video learn something and uh, let me know if you guys end up making one too all right thanks take care